Now, de Klerk was the last president of the apartheid era and was a key player in the country's transition to democracy. He is survived by his wife, Elita, two children, Susan and Young, and his grandchildren. ENCA's Lee McCabe compiled this report. Frederick Willem de Klerk was the president of South Africa from September 1989 until May 1994. His legacy is that of playing a key role in the negotiations which led to the unbanning of liberation movements and helped facilitate the country's transition to democracy. De Klerk was the last president of the apartheid era and the seventh head of state. It was during his tenure that Nelson Mandela was freed after 27 years of imprisonment. Following Mandela's release, the two worked together to bring an end to the policy of racial segregation and transformed South Africa into the constitutional democracy that it is today. After the first democratic multiracial election in April 1994, Nelson Mandela was elected as the country's first black head of state. De Klerk became one of two deputy presidents under Mandela, serving from 1994 to 1996 in the Government of National Unity, which was dedicated to healing the divisions and conflicts of our past. De Klerk won the Nobel Peace Prize in 1993 for the role that he played in bringing about the peaceful termination of the apartheid regime. The F.W. de Klerk Foundation has stated that the family would make an announcement about funeral arrangements in due course. Lee McCabe, Johannesburg.